It's Wednesday, May 15th. I'm Emily Walsh, here to report the daily headlines. Suzanne Atwell and Susan Chapman win in the City of Sarasota runoff elections. This will be Chapman's first term on the Sarasota City Commission while Atwell held onto her seat in the election. About 20% of residents turned out to cast their ballot in last night's runoff election, which is about 950 more people than the March election. Atwell was the top vote-getter with about 38.5% of votes. Chapman garnered about 32.6%. Atwell and Chapman will be sworn in at noon Friday. A Mar Vista site plan amendment attracts Long Beach Village residents' opposition. Although three people spoke in opposition of a Mar Vista dockside restaurant and pub site plan amendment at Longboat Key Town Commission's May 6 regular meeting, dozens more have overloaded commissioners' emails against the project. Residents are concerned a Mar Vista expansion means the restaurant could now serve 331 patrons. According to owner Ed Childs, there is a lot of misinformation going around. Long Beach Village Association is sending out a petition to residents asking them to sign if they object to this growth in traffic, noise, and parking. Owners of the DeSoto Speedway hope to revive the South's fastest short track. Kevin Williams and Mike Chase closed DeSoto Speedway in East County in late February. Since its closure, the two have patched up the track, redone the bathrooms and food service, lowered ticket prices, and installed more stands. The two entrepreneurs have also rebranded the track Full Throttle Speedway. They hope to host an annual Speed Week event leading up to the Daytona 500. Even bigger plans include a fan zone where fans can buy higher priced tickets and be escorted into the pit to meet drivers and watch as they fix their cars. This week, Foodie Feasts in Southside Village. Check out her restaurant recommendations. Southside Village stretches from Hyde Park Street North to Prospect Street and South Tamiami Trail west to Osprey Avenue. Food editor Molly Schechter dined at some of her favorite places and shares her experience in this week's diversions. Locations include Libby's Cafe and Bar, Serving Spoon, Lucia's Pizza Italian Grill, Nick's Tavern and Grill, Sam Sneed's, and Morton's Gourmet Market. Pick up a copy of Diversions for more information and be sure to stop by Southside Village with an appetite. Those are some of my favorite restaurants. Yummy. That's all for today's headlines. For more community and breaking news, go online to yourobserver.com daily and pick up a copy of the Longboat and East County Observer Wednesday and the Sarasota Observer and Pelican Press Thursday. You, your neighbors, your neighborhood.